Hi, it's Alex. This is a bit of an announcement that for the next month, I am going to experiment with continuing to make videos, but not posting them on social media. And in this video, I want to explain why I'm making this choice. And I hope that by watching this, you can gain some insight that will enrich your life. I've found that social media can be a huge time sink. And I've also found that it's not the most effective way to share material, and it's not the most effective way to market a website, a business, a YouTube channel, or ideas. Social media giants like Facebook, Twitter, and to some degree Tumblr, they all have more or less the same business model, which is that they make money off advertising, and they make more money if they are able to keep people on their website or app longer. So the activity that happens on Facebook generates profit for them, whereas if people leave Facebook and go to an external site, like YouTube or like any other website that you might share, they're not making money while you're on that other site. And I think that this creates a bad incentive. Like, I'm sharing my material on Facebook not because I want to keep people on Facebook, but because I want people to come to my channel and watch my videos. And what happens? Well, I have a lot of data from the past several years of running my channel, and it shows me pretty consistently that when I share something on Facebook, there's often a lot more activity on Facebook itself than on my YouTube channel. In many cases, more people will like my post than actually watch the video, especially if I look at who watches the video coming from Facebook. Even more common than this, far more people are posting comments on Facebook than on the YouTube channel. And I really don't like this, because if you post comments on my post on Facebook, very few people can read them. Only the people who, according to whoever's privacy settings are, only the people who are connected to that person on Facebook see it. Whereas when you post it on my YouTube channel, I feel like it's, it's sharing it there for everyone. And that's what I want. I want to create a dialogue that everyone can see. And from my perspective, it's not benefiting me, and it's not in line with the purpose of the channel if you just keep that dialogue on Facebook. Also, I don't like Facebook. I think Facebook is bad for our society, I think it's bad for people's mental health, and when you are engaging in dialogue on Facebook, you are kind of creating content that Facebook is then going to capitalize on. Because when other people read your comment, including me, these people are now staying on Facebook, and that time on Facebook is going to be time that Facebook can profit off of. So basically, the same thing is true of Twitter, it's true of Tumblr too, so I want to do this experiment. I, over the next month, I'm going to continue to make videos. I'm not going to post them on any social media. If you want to share them, go ahead. Go for it. Uh, what I really care about though, I want people to watch my videos. Um, lastly, I want to talk a little bit about mental health, because this is something I struggle with, and I see a lot of other people struggling with it as well. I think social media is not great for people's mental health, and this is something where I, I felt this personally. When I spend more time on, so on social media, especially on Facebook, I find myself getting angry more, and I don't like this. This has caused some tension with some of my friends. I've had a lot of tension because of Facebook dialogues, and I've noticed that a certain type of conflict seems to happen pretty consistently on Facebook dialogues that doesn't seem to happen in real life. And so that's yet another reason why I want to stay away from it. Now it's like, yeah, a lot of this stuff could go wrong on YouTube too, but at least YouTube, you're directly watching my message or whatever other thing you're wanting to watch. It's not like you're getting caught into this sort of user-generated content mess. So um, basically that's what I have to say. Um, I'd love to hear from you, and I'm going to emphasize this. If you want to comment about this, please comment on my YouTube channel, and that holds for always. Please don't comment on my social media posts. Please add the commentary on the YouTube video itself, because that way other people can see it, and you're not sort of keeping the dialogue away from my channel, which is what enriches these social media giants and kind of hurts me. Same goes for when other people share their material. 
yeah, that's what I have to say, and I hope that you all will stay with me over the next month, that you will c continue coming to my channel and watching my videos, because I really appreciate that. Thank you!